Welcome, 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 collective to Queen Sophie Real Tarot. Here with a general message for the collective. I'm going to take what resonates and to leave what does not. If this message does not resonate with you, then, you know, just somebody else's message, okay? Let it fly. Okay, remember the energy is fluid. It could be either masculine or feminine, so please reverse the roles when necessary. Thanks for subscribe, subscribing to my channel. So all my new subscribers, thank you, thank you, thank you. I see you. You know, I appreciate you. Okay. Thanks for all the likes, the shares, and the comments that y'all leave me out. I, I thank you so much. What do we have here to that spirit? Please and thank you. What is the message for the collective here? What's the energy here, spirit? Please and thank you. We have the daughter romance here. The number 33 could be significant. Okay, I'm hearing somebody's open for it here. What else is here to fast fear? Somebody's ready to open up their heart. Here's what I'm getting here. What's the energy here, spirit? Please and thank you. Yeah. But, yeah. They're ready for it, but they don't want any hostilities here. Okay. They're not going to let anybody come in to their life, you know, with any type of aggression here. I mean, they just want to be loved here. That's just what I'm getting here. Without the fights and the argument here, okay? Yeah. This romance, they, 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 they call it for it to be protected here. Once they open it up, they don't want no hostilities. They want um, Archangel Michael's here to protect them. Um, along the journey, okay, um, during their romantic endeavor here, what they're seeking here, okay, the love with them, without any hostilities here, without any complications is what I'm getting here, Arch Archangel Michael's here to uh, protect this person's uh, feelings, okay, and protect this person's uh, romance here, this person's heart is what I'm getting here. What else is here, Divine Spirit? Please and thank you. Hang on. Yeah, somebody here is uh, protecting themselves from getting their heart broke here. Okay, somebody's not going to take that chance. Okay, so they're praying for some protection here in the relationship. Here is what I'm getting here. What else is here to best spirit? Please and thank you. What's the energy here for the collective? Yeah. Hmm. It's looking for some security here, some strength. Okay, maybe this is something you've been waiting for for a long time and you're not going to, you know, uh, take any chances with anybody. You want to be for sure about this relationship is what I'm getting here. What's here, Divine Spirit? Please and thank you. You have a man holding the coin, okay? They're going to have to be financially stable. I'm here, you got specific requests here. Okay, as far as what you want out of a romantic relationship. Okay. Or you're willing to accept somebody if they don't, you know, if they're not um, financially stable yet. Okay. They're going to eventually, you're going to want them to be uh, financially stable, but you're willing to accept someone that's not even financially stable right now. As long as they're not hostile, here's what I'm getting here. As long as they're not violent or anything like that or, you know, um, mean to you, toward, you know, towards you in any type of way here. Okay. You want to be protected in this relationship, okay? You don't want anything that's in balance. You don't want any lies or deceit here is what I'm getting here. Well, you're not going to commit with anybody that's violent is what I'm getting here. Violent or has, you know, any type of violent tendencies or, you know, uh, hostile in any way is what I'm getting here. What else is here, Spirit? Please and thank you. What else is here? Yeah, because you're just nothing but, you know, a pure portrait of love here. Okay, for masculine. Okay, you're a divine love here. You're an angel of love here. Okay, that's that's, that's something you represent here. And that's why Archangel Michael here is to protect you on your journey here. Okay, wow, to protect you on your journey here as far as your romance. And you opening up the door, opening up your heart, or opening up the door to romance here in your life here is what I'm getting here. Let's see what we have going on here. 
What is it that the collector needs to be aware of? Please and thank you, Divine Spirit. Yeah, because you're looking back and you want changes made in your life here. Okay. Wow. Yeah, you want changes. You're healing from something here. You want changes to come in your life, into your life as quickly as you before you let somebody else into your heart is what I'm getting here. What else is here, Divine Spirit? Your guardian angels are going to protect you from anybody coming into your energy or into your space or into uh, trying to get into any um, relationship uh, romantically with you. Um, you're protected by uh, the guardian angels here is what I'm getting here. Okay. I'm getting uh, with the man holding the coin. You don't expect a whole lot from your person here, but your person is going to have to come in with true love. And like I said, without any hostilities or any anger issues or anything like that, you're not going to deal with that anymore. Okay. What's here? What's the collective needs to be aware of? Spirit, please and thank you. Yeah. You want something that, that's abundant. Something's going to bring you some abundance, some fulfillment here. Okay. Yeah. You're keeping a mind, a positive mindset here. Okay. I'm hearing it's not all about the money all the time. I'm hearing you say that it's not all about the money. It's about the principle, okay? It's about the loyalty. It's about the care. It's about the respect. You know, I hear you, okay? And until that, you don't have any stability if you don't have those things here is what I hear you say, collective. Okay, what else is here, Divine Spirit? Yeah, you don't want anybody coming in false or anything like that before you, you give your, the key to your heart to anybody here, okay? You're not giving the key to your heart to anybody here, collective, okay? You're not opening up your heart or the door to romance to anybody, here um unless they can fulfill those things in your life here is what i'm getting here because you don't you don't, you don't want to be um heartbroken again okay because you're an angel of love here okay so your, your prayers have been heard is what i'm getting here your prayers have been heard okay your guardian angels are here to protect you okay well you're, you're tired of codependent relationships okay relationships that don't work out that don't pan out you know, they never seem to, to, to work out in your favor, even though you're the angel of love here, uh, feel masculine. It never seems to work out for you. You don't feel that it's fair. So you put some, you know, you, you, you put some demands out there in the universe and, and, and you know, in the spiritual realm that this is what you want. And you're not going to settle for anything less. Okay. It's just hard to heal in your heart over and over again. You get in relationships, they work out, you know, they start out working fine, and then all of a sudden, uh, the first hiccup, and the person wants to bail on you, or they want to, you know, start to mess with you, or want to get violent with you, you know. Take it how it resonates here, okay? Wow. You want somebody that's going to match you. You want somebody, I'm hearing you want the person that God made for you. That's what I'm hearing you say. You're not going to settle for anybody that's going to hurt you or harm you or mistreat you in any way here, collective, is what I'm getting here. Or or use you, or use you for your money, okay? Or use you for uh, just a roof over, there, over over their head or anything. You're not you're not going for that type of thing, okay? Well, I'm hearing you, you've been heartbroken enough here, okay? You, you, you're, you're not going to be addicted to any, anybody that's obsessive or possessive or controlling, okay? Or to try to, you know, constrain you, put constraints on you in any kind of way, try to tell you what to do, okay? Or somebody just codependent, they just real needy. You're not going to deal with those type of people here, okay? When you not open up your heart, when you open up your heart um, to romance, you like I said, you got some restrictions here, okay? Spirit is saying, voice your opinion, voice how you feel here, okay? We got the Grim Reaper here, okay? Yeah. You're not going to give nobody no second chances. The, the, the first sign, the first suspect sign anybody give you, it's over. The relationship is over. And I think you're going to make that plain to whoever tries to come in and, and to you, um, ro towards you romantically collective here. Okay? You're going to let them know. All right? You may, some of you may be doing some online dating here, and maybe these are some of the qualifications that you put up for your person here. I'm, I'm hearing that you, you're setting some boundaries, and, and yeah, I, I'm happy for you for setting up these boundaries, you know? You need to let it, let a person know how you feel up front, you know? Don't let them have to figure it out later on, you know? Communication is key, always. Let the person know what you want, what you expect, and you know, and, and stand on what you say and, and say what you mean, mean what you say, and stand on it. And the people will respect that, you know. So, if this is something that you want here, Spirit is saying, say what you mean and mean what you say and stand on it. 
Stand your ground. Okay? That's what Spirit is saying here. This is truly what you want here. Okay? Your guardian angels are here to, to protect you. Mike, Archangel Michael is here to protect you here. For you to get this uh, 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 door to romance here. For that right person to come, you know, to come into your life. Okay? Wow. Making a way for everything that your heart desires here. That's what Spirit said. What else is here? In love. Everything you desire in love here. And everything that you don't want. Okay, everything has been, yeah, I'm, I'm hearing the table's been set for you by the divine universe here. Spirit said yes. Wow, what else is here, divine spirit? Please and thank you. Final message for the collective. Please and thank you. Yeah. Endings bring new beginnings here. Okay. You're ready for a change here. Okay. And if you don't get things, have things your way collective. I'm, I'm here. You're like, hey, it's either my way or the highway because you're willing to be by yourself. To be with somebody who's going to try to confine you, restrict you, or be, be possessive, be controlling, or be obsessive or codependent with you. Okay. You, you, you don't want nobody that has no restraints on you. Okay. Well, you'd rather be free before you go back into a relationship like that again. This is what I hear you say. Okay, Spirit, so you're absolutely right. But at the end of the day, it's your choice, okay? Hmm. But I always just have faith that love is coming. Okay, as long as you put the, 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 the right um, thoughts and the right intentions out there, you know, that's what you get in return, okay? Well, Spirit saying, you know, always treat people the way you want to be treated and start it off that way and speak out about what you want. Communication is key. It's what I keep getting here, okay? Okay? Well... But Spirit is calling for you to have faith and for you to know that, you know, this true love is coming. Um, number 33 here, you can't open up your heart, okay? And uh, true love can come in. It's what you invite in is, is, is what Spirit is saying. It's what you invite in, okay? Don't be hesitant to speak on what, you, what, what your demands are, what you expect out of a relationship is what Spirit is saying here. Don't be afraid to speak out about what you want, what's going to make you happy. If this, this person can't fulfill all of that, then that's not the person for you. I'm just saying, I mean... Don't hesitate on telling this person what you want, what you expect, what you need, what your needs are, okay? Because you're important, okay? That's what Spirit is saying here. Know that you are important. Know that you are worthy. Know that you can have the things that your heart desires is what I'm getting here. So I'm going to end the message here, okay? Wow. With love, truth, and light, okay? And um, good luck to, to you guys out there that are uh, seeking this uh, daughter romance here, okay? Because you're going to get what you ask for, okay? Thanks again, and peace for now. All right.